Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am reviewing Pharmacy's Honey Halo Ultra Hydrating Ceramide Moisturizer, which looks like this. Before we begin with today's video, I'd love to welcome everyone who has recently subscribed to my channel. Welcome, my name is Nadia and I am a licensed esthetician who loves to test and review skincare products. Be sure to follow me on all of my other social media platforms. I will link those down below for you. And also if you have yet to subscribe, be sure to subscribe and to hit that notification bell so that you are notified whenever I make a brand new upload. Honey Halo is a rich cream loaded with antioxidants and skin replenishing ingredients to hydrate, plump, and improve the look of fine lines and wrinkles. You can find Honey Halo at Sephora and pharmacy.com. She does retail for $45 and you do receive 1.7 ounces. Within this formula, we see buckwheat honey, which hydrates, soothes, and renews the skin. Propolis and Royal Jelly, a humectant blend, provide the skin with intense moisture and antioxidant protection to help neutralize environmental damage. We also see fig fruit extract, which contains humectants that help bind moisture to the skin. The shea butter and vitamin E here nourish and moisturize the skin while also soothing and giving the skin anti-inflammatory benefits. We do see a plant ceramide blend that rehydrates and helps the skin retain its moisture and protects the skin's barrier. As we age, the quality and quantity of ceramides within the skin depletes. As soon as we hit our 30s, ceramide levels drop about 10 to 15 percent every 10 years. Luckily, topical application of ceramides will help to replenish damaged ceramides. I began using Honey Halo on September 2nd and I noticed that it applied very nicely over the skin. The moisturizer was instantly plumping and it felt a little tacky over the skin but as soon as I woke up the next morning I didn't see or feel that filmy layer you sometimes see with some oils or very rich creams. On the third application, I did notice how easily this applied over the skin. It was almost like butter. And then I noticed, uh, at least on my normal skin, that less is definitely more with Honey Halo. Um, so I just applied the tiniest bit over my skin and we were good to go. Honey Halo, uh, despite it being such a rich cream, did not break me out at all. In the middle of the month, I did begin to pair it with Pharmacy's Honeymoon Glow. Uh, now this is a brand new unit. I did empty out my older one um, that I have used for a while now and this pairing is a very, a very lovely. Pharmacy's Honeymoon Glow. It is a blend of 14% alpha hydroxy and BHA and flower acids. So this will exfoliate the skin very very nicely. This product in particular has more more of an anti kind of acne effect over my skin personally so um, I do use this um, the week before or the week of my cycle to minimize that hormonal breakout but this pairing here is to die for. So with this combo here, I definitely noticed that my skin would wake up smoother, plumper, and moisturized. I have used a number of ceramide rich moisturizers and serums. This one feels really nice over the skin and it doesn't feel heavy over the skin despite again it being such a rich cream. Um, because I have normal skin. Um, this would definitely be more of a seasonal item for this 
or for me. Um, I am just using this during the summertime because I'm testing this for for you. But I can definitely see myself putting this to really, really good use during the drier, colder winter months. My overall results have been moisturized, supple, skin. This plays very well with other products I have used. Because Honey Halo is such a rich cream, I did not use this during the day. But if you have dry, chapped skin, this will do wonders for your skin. Dry skin is typically uh, dull, so if you have dry, chapped skin, uh, I would definitely use this during the day and night for relief, moisture, plumper skin with a luminous finish. If you have normal skin, however, that just needs moisture, um, I feel like your skin will really, really soak this up. But again, just use it at night. Because this was rich enough for me, I did not pair this with an oil, but I think that it will definitely work very well with an oil if you do decide to go that route. I love, love using this at night with my um, Peter Thomas Roth clarifying liquid. And on my other nights, I loved pairing it with Honeymoon Glow for more of an intense resurfacing, plumping effect to the skin. I would recommend Honey Halo to dry, chapped, Normal skin that is looking for intense moisture, antioxidant protection, and skin replenishing ingredients. As far as pros are concerned, um, this is a very, very moisturizing. I'm obsessed over the fact that this is not fragranced. It is cruelty free. Uh, packaging is recyclable. This is a glass jar and the packaging itself is absolutely beautiful. Um, and you also have a magnetic spatula here so you will never lose her and you will never have to dip your fingers into the jar at all. Again, no fragrance and no sensitizing or poor ingredients were included in this formula, so that is amazing. Um, and also, despite me having normal skin, Honey Halo did not break me out during the test of this product. Cons, I have none. I have none. I feel like they covered all of their bases with giving you a spatula. It's magnetized, you'll never lose it. You don't have to dip your fingers into this. A little bit goes a long way if you have a normal skin. Pharmacy is cruelty free and it's recyclable. I am actually going to be rating Honey Halo a 10 out of 10. Um, this product definitely delivers on its claims. It's cruelty free and there are no poor or sensitizing ingredients that I could find and this was actually such a joy to test uh, despite us being in the butt end of summer here. I really liked the fact that this did not break me out and it did not further congest my normal skin. I didn't see like a, a, an increase in blackheads or congestion throughout the skin at all. This will definitely work best on normal dry chapped skin. If you do have oily skin and are in need of a moisturizer, I could recommend Daily Greens from the same uh, range, pharmacy, or uh, Better Days, which has it's still creamy. It's a whipped cream type of moisturizer, but it's not as rich a cream as this babe is. That is all I have for today's video. Thank you so much for spending some time with me today. I hope that you enjoyed today's video, and I will see you in the next one. Bye. We made it and now at 6.49 it is time to get some lunch.